All right, let's talk, let's talk about um, my favorite drink ever in the whole wide world, soft drinks. Oh, yeah. I thought you were going to say Hell no. I was like, huh? It's fucked outside. Um, yeah, <laughs> no. Okay, Coke is obviously one of the biggest brands in the world. Um, they've uh, Their their Diet Coke is like a cult. Is it a, is. It's it has a cult fan base. It's yep. a cult hero. Mm-hmm. That silver Diet can, especially in, like, in the early 2000s, like it was the biggest thing ever. Mm-hmm. Well, that like, was the only option. Or yes. like diet soda. Yep. And like the association I get, I don't know why. It's like the Diet Coke can with like what's those like velvety sweatsuits that the Juicy bed bees would have on? Juicy track Is that suit. It? Yep. It's couture? Juicy on the ass. Yeah. Juicy couture? Juicy couture, yeah. I've never looked there, but Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um that's like kind of the association I get. What? With Diet, with Diet Coke for like some reason. Like the type of person that would drink Diet yeah. Coke yeah. wears a juicy track suit. Like Paris Hilton, That's Metal That's so straw. interesting. Yeah, I can see it. Early yeah. 2000s. But currently, I don't picture that girl drinking Diet Coke. I don't see Diet Coke. Well, in New Zealand, it's Coke, no sugar. Do we not have Diet Coke? We here? have Diet Coke, but yeah. the cult like, following in New Zealand drinks Coke, no sugar. Yeah. Coke, no sugar in New Zealand tastes better than Diet Coke. Coke, no sugar in New Zealand is the holy grail. Yeah. But in the U.S., it's Diet Coke. They also have Coke Zero yeah. slash Coke No Sugar in the U.S., but most yeah. people drink Diet Coke. I think it's purely like a habit thing. Like, mm. the, like the come up of Diet Coke was huge in the U.S., and now they're yep. kind of stuck on it. Yep. But I will admit that Diet Coke in the U.S. tastes better than Diet Coke in New Zealand. Actually? Yes. Like, in New Zealand, I drink oh, okay. Coke No Sugar. Yeah, yeah, In the U.S., I drink Diet Coke. Word. Okay. Yeah. That's interesting. What is it? Is it like sweeter and stuff? Or? Um... I honestly couldn't tell you why. Yeah. It's just my vibe. Fair. Yeah. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. But I fucking love it, unfortunately. <laughs> like, I actually love it. Like, it make, it's like, life is worth living. <laughs> like, the first step for me is actually that yeah. I froth Diet Coke. Well, not Diet Coke. Yeah. Coke, no sugar. And I have one almost every day of it's my bad. life. And I always put citrus in it. Yeah. Specifically true lime, which is like this little sachet yeah, of dehydrated yeah. lime, which I also discovered on TikTok. Are you bougie with from it? From the Diet Coke community. Bro. And yeah, lots of ice, yeah. citrus, coat no sugar. Oh my God. My, I'm salivating. Yeah. That's so good to me. But you need to let that go because one day you'll go to the dentist and get 20 fillings and three root canals. Yeah, Dow just got the bill of his life. Yeah, 2K. And I just spent... Root um, canal's crazy at 23. I've had a couple. Uh, Is that crazy? I'm okay. shook. Turkey, here we go. <laughs> I've, I've had a couple. I'm dead. I thought Rugen was like really, no, dude, really I, bad. No, one time I went to like get my teeth checked up, like right before I turned 18. My dad was like, let's run the shit up. Like, right before. now. Uh-huh. And I'm pretty sure I've had work done on like 85% of my teeth. That's insane. No yeah. wonder you're so chill about it. Because I was like, Rugen, my jaw literally dropped when you said that. I was like, huh? Yeah. No, it's chill, bro. Just another I've day. I've only had fillings way. before. And I went a long time with no fillings until yeah. I turned 18. I literally didn't have any. Like, I didn't even make the most out of this free dentistry. Yeah, yeah. Um, So I had no fillings until I was 18. And then I didn't go to the dentist for like three years because I had to pay for it at that point. Mm. So then I went when I was like 22, 23. And I was in Mexico. So I was like, all right, let's fucking go. Like, hello, right. it's way yeah. cheaper. So I went to the dentist. It was like my second to last day in Mexico because I'm a procrastinator. Yep. And I went to the dentist and she was like, five, you've got five fillings. Yeah. And I was like, fuck, can you do them all like right here, right now? So I literally just went like, did three that day, two the yeah. next day. And then I've been good ever since. Damn. All right. So not Turkey, Mexico, here we go. Yeah. Is it, like, it's a lot cheaper, obviously. Yeah, way cheaper. Yeah. I, it's not as cheap as like, Turkey or Southeast Asia, mm. but um, definitely cheap. I probably yeah. paid like two hundred and fifty bucks for five fillings, which is insanely cheap. Two hundred fifty. Yeah, and she Damn. was like a really nice dentist as well in yeah. Mexico. But then last year in Brazil, I didn't need any work done. I just had a clean. Yeah. Um, and did I have a filling? No, I just had a clean. Fair. Um, but my mum literally took me to the bougiest dentist in the whole city, like. And I pretty much paid New Zealand prices. I was like, well, what yeah. are we here for? <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Back to Diet Coke, though. Um, I think the, the rise of Diet Coke obviously comes with, like, American culture being so obese at the time. Like, especially, like, in the oh, yeah, 80s makes- and 90s. Like, 
every every fast food every food item was getting bigger in the states it's still it's now the biggest obesity country in the world i think america is the most obese country in the world oh yeah i, I think kuwait's up there though which I, is crazy yeah because like well, that makes sense now that i know you but you didn't live there did you whoa <laughs> Wait, you what the fuck there. is wrong yo what the fuck <laughs> what do you mean I think that was so wrong. You live there, right? Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> you, you looked okay. at me and said, yeah, the, I can tell the country you come from is fucking obese. Are you crazy? <laughs> um, No, not because of the way you look. I would just like to make that clear. I was not obese. Um, But the, this man's eating <laughs> habits... This man's <laughs> eating habits are something like I've never seen before. Like he loves a sweet treat. Like he loves a sweet treat. And it's not like a sweet treat a day. It's like a sweet treat an hour. Like a sweet treat after every Breakfast, lunch, dinner. Yeah. Type like after shit. every meal. I, um, yeah. I haven't tried the ice cream taco yet. What are you waiting so for? So disciplined. It's going to run out. So disciplined. They have a limited, limited stock. I'm waiting. For, I don't know what I'm waiting for. But yeah, now that I know you and how much you love sugar, well, not even sugar, you just love food, which period, so do I. Yeah. Live for it. One of the best things yeah. in, the, in the world to do is go out for a nice meal. Yeah. Um, I just know your friend will love this. That makes sense. <laughs> Why would she love this? I don't know. You're just dunking on me <laughs> for 10 minutes straight. What the fuck did I do to you? Fair. Adele, you can't deny that. I hate, a sweet treat hates to see you coming. A chocolate bar hates to see you coming. A chocolate yeah. ice cream hates to see you coming. Yeah, maybe. Allegedly. Something like that. I also, we were just talking about how you have eight fillings in a root canal. Like, as a joke. Um, you yeah. also what? What? You were about to say something. I was just going to go back to Diet Coke for once, but you so want to So do fucking... you drink Diet Fizzy or do you drink full sugar fizzy when you indulge? All the which above. is every day. All the above. <laughs> No, I do it all. Dude, I yesterday I had solo. Oh. It's like this like Australian lemonade yeah. Where lemon did you drink. From? This like Indian spot. Oh yeah. Um Yeah, man. Um I've I'm trying to avoid sugar, but like there is there's such a big difference in taste between no sugar and sugary That's drinks. why you add citrus. What is it is it are you talking like citric acid? Citrus. What do you what do you mean Sorry. citrus? Citrus. Is lemon, limes, oranges, yeah. grapefruit, like that category yeah. okay. of fruit. Yeah. And it cuts the taste of the sweetener. It's so good. I have some. I have some here for you to try, actually. Oh, well, I Coke. guess I'm going to have to get a Coke now. Uh. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> You're a dick. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, so the... The lime yeah. cuts the taste of the sweetener. Yeah. Also drink it without the sweetener, don't get me wrong. Like I still love yeah, it. Yeah. But it makes it taste so much better. Yeah. It makes it taste like a full yeah. sugar drink. And, and obviously, like if I'm drinking a diet a diet drink or a no sugar drink, I do feel less guilty. Because mm. like it it does feel lighter, like as a as a drink. Really? Yeah, yeah, like the, the sugary drinks feel more syrupy for me. Right. If, I don't drink any full sugar. You don't? No. Nah, ever. Same. I only drink diet, like um, Sprite Zero, really good as well. Like yeah. way less of like a sweetener taste than yeah. a Coke. Yeah. So I would try that. But like, I just can't. <laughs> what? I would try that. Try that if you're like anti-sweetener. <laughs> and try that. But if you, I f like one thing about me, I'm going to eat my calories. I am yeah. not going to drink my calories unless yeah. I'm drinking something like a milkshake or something. Yeah. Then that's different. But if I'm drinking fizzy. Why the fuck would I get full, full sugar? Yeah. What a waste of calories. Yeah. Be, you'd be stupid if you did that. Mm. 